It will be a day of somber memorials in Hawaii today, 75 years after the Japanese carried out the attack on the American fleet at Pearl Harbor. One family will be there today to reunite long-lost twin brothers. Eyewitness News reporter Brian Yokono is live in the newsroom with a story that's new this morning. Julianne, thank you. Today, families across the country pausing to remember loved ones. And this morning, we are introducing you to one family remembering two men. 75 years ago today, this is the place that ripped John Anderson's family apart. He said he felt like that he let Jake down and that he let the family down because he couldn't get him. John on the left, his twin brother Jake on the right, were both on the USS Arizona when they were attacked. In different parts of the ship, Jake died. John searched but was ordered off the ship as explosions continued. He dodged fate that day more than once as he and another sailor headed back toward the Arizona. And they were able to pick up four people on the way back to the Arizona. And uh, when they got hit by an explosion and that survived that and Rose and the rest of the guys they picked up were gone. John returned to Pearl Harbor over the years. His dying wish last November at the age of 98 was to be interred on the Arizona. He wanted to be, come back and be interred with Jake there on the Arizona and the other men that he was with. A oh, good time for us to say goodbye to him. And he would like that. He loved family. And we've learned now that John's remains will be interred in gun turret number four, which was his battle station. In the newsroom, Brian Yacono, Eyewitness News.